a World War II Pearl Harbor hero was finally laid to rest 80 years after his passing. U.S. Navy Ensign Francis Flaherty was killed in the attack on Pearl Harbor in 1941. Francis Flaherty died trying to protect and save his shipmates during the attack. He was awarded the Medal of Honor for his heroic work. However his remains weren't identified until two years ago in 2019. For the last 80 years his remains were buried in one of the graves of the unknowns at a cemetery known as the Punchbowl in Honolulu. He has now been brought back to rest at his home to Charlotte, North Carolina. There were many acts of extraordinary heroism at Pearl Harbor and they were performed in myriad ways. Flaherty, who was an ensign at the time of the attack, was aboard the USS Oklahoma. Flaherty's Medal of Honor reads, for extraordinary devotion to duty and extraordinary courage and complete disregard of his own life, when it was seen the USS Oklahoma was going to capsize and the order was given to abandon ship, Ensign Flaherty remained in the turret, holding a flashlight so the remainder of the turret crew could see a pathway to escape, thereby sacrificing his own life for his men. 429 men were entombed in the Oklahoma at Pearl Harbor, including Flaherty, after the great ship rolled over. The ship was raised for salvage in 1943, and the remains inside were eventually interred in mass graves marked unknowns at the National Memorial Cemetery of the Pacific in Honolulu.